All right, welcome back everybody and buckle in because we just got done with a just a killer Lilith run and now we're on keeper leaves only one two three four five five remaining before we're finally around the circle uh, from whence we came and uh, <laughs> Yeah, that's exciting. I gotta get my something's wrong like ah, oh, okay, okay one of the back uh, security What is it called the uh, stabilizers? You know every, every keyword has two like legs um for some reason, one of mine was knocked out. Uh, how are you guys doing? I'm good. It's uh, it's a, it's a good day for me. I'm playing on a Thursday, which for some who are new, I work four tens during the week. So this is my uh, this is start of my weekend. This is my new Friday night, baby. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and we're kicking it off with Keeper. Um, that's funny. I I do like everything Jar. There's just no room for it on the current mission. I'm surprised it's a tier three item though. That seems generous uh, for that, because there's a lot of—I mean, there's a lot of tier three items that are just a million percent better. Like Jacob's Ladder. Let's let's say that is actually a tier three item. Um, Magic Fingers is cool. It would also work really well with the character. Um, and let's talk about him a little bit. So we've got Keeper here. Doesn't actually have HP in a regular sense. A few of the characters don't. He's I think the remaining one who uh, really does have something unique going on, and um, it's money. So he's a straight money character. And I remember when this guy was new, um, and like the unlock for him is to get all your pennies figured out on greed mode. I think you get the character by putting 999 pennies in greed mode. I mean, dude, that was, that's kind of a fun, I like it, honestly, because it, it is, it takes a long time of like grinding and then you get the character and when the character came out he used to have only 2 HP so the 3 HP thing is new uh, relatively speaking new um, so just oh. so as you can see that's a quick little demo uh, and this is not gonna be an edited video so sit tight I, I was uh, so the first video dropped um, which means now I can you know read the, the feedback and it sounds like you know the people who have been here a while they, they like seeing unedited so I uh, listen man if, if it's me you want it's me you got okay <laughs> so quarter's cool there and i uh, listen all right we'll do it we'll do it the long way this time i'm i'm no stranger to a good time and uh buddy we are describing a good time so oh my gosh i'm so dumb i'm so dumb i'm so so dang dumb i should have been saving my money i wanted to play the sacrifice room on this floor i would have been able to get all the way down um that's frustrating because I, sh I should definitely have been playing that better um, but we have more opportunities for that, and that's something to look forward to on future floors that are bigger, that we get more, you know, pennies laying around for, and um, something just something just to keep in mind. Nothing wrong with leaving this floor with 37 cents, okay? There's really, really nothing terrible about that. And uh, we did get the... What was I thinking? Oh, nice. Uh, we did get the Tinted Rock to break there, so that's pretty sweet. Got a free tinted rock exploration. Uh, we're gonna use our trapdoor. I love trapdoors in this game. I really do. And a spider bite is an, an insane one. Um, get that. We get 25% chance to slow. It looks like it was affected by luck, but in what way? Let me see that again. Okay. Oh, 15%. Okay, 15 luck and it's 100% chance. Well, I've got good news and bad news in that sense. Um, we are pretty much always going to be we're gonna get a lot of luck up pennies okay it's, it's possible that's, that's something to keep an eye out for for sure um for sure for sure when we get wooden nickel rolling you know there's really no stopping stopping me and we're gonna do this emperor card you know i'm i'm actually totally fine with and just because it's five cents and we want it out of the pool we'll get magic fingers out of here how does that sound so we've got an emperor card we've got nothing else on this floor and uh, we've got we've got each other. That's all we need. And I'm excited. I I really can't think of the last time I played Keeper. It's fun to think about the Keeper um, as a character. Like when he came out, uh, he sucked. <laughs> uh, I I think you actually have to unlock the wooden nickel to start with. So uh, honestly, a struggle. And I respect I respect that choice. By the way, I think making the character slightly easier by accomplishing things with him is a, a totally fair way to make this character better in this roguelike. I mean, sometimes that, that effect doesn't always work, you know, like with roguelikes, you get to start pimping out the character a little too much, and then it's, you know, then it's not really roguelike anymore. It's like an upgrade your character type of thing. Um, and sometimes roguelikes are just straight more difficult. 
Whoa. Sometimes it's just adding more difficulty for nothing. And you know what's really good about... Oh, no. Oh, you know what I should do? I'm going to disconnect from the internet. Boom. How did I do that? I unplugged my phone, ladies and gentlemen. I unplugged my phone. Oh, my gosh. It's so... It's so I, I hope to God that this does not screw up my... Uh, recording that would really blow because this is a cool character and uh, it's the last thing I want right is to screw that up so we got book of virtues which uh, <laughs> actually kind of sucks because um, we were hoping to get a deal with the devil and there's our sacrifice room so you know what we got another chance I was hoping to get a deal with the devil because uh, it costs money as the keeper you know, let's, it makes the Keeper a lot better. They used to be, so... <laughs> when the Keeper first came out, he needed work. He spawned with 2 HP, which is what the Tainted Keeper is, I believe, now. Um, and with Tainted Keeper, that, that's honestly fine. I get it. But, dude, when he this guy dropped and d deals with the Devil still cost Red Hearts. And what I mean is, like, uh, it would cost your whole bag just to get... <laughs> um... Uh, unfortunately, I have to pick these up. It cost everything just to get a deal with the devil. It would kill you. You really couldn't take them. So, you know, that, that, that's changed a lot in a, in for, in a, good, in a great way. 100% um, in a great way for the better. Uh, we'll get down chest. Okay. We're not getting great payouts, but the, the point is, this is one of those runs you have an opportunity to, to abuse something. And what do I mean by that is we, we have a ton of... Oh. The Wisps have a chance to drop coins, potentially? Is that what I just saw? Oh! Well, well, well. That is... That is something to learn. But the thing we're... The, 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 the thing we're really making use of is... Okay. Oh, nice. Celtic Cross or the body. The body doesn't actually do anything for us. So, we're gonna roll with Celtic Cross. And I, I've already lost my train of thought. We're trying to manipulate the game a little bit. There's some, there's some parts of the game that if you have immunity towards, like if you can do something in this game. And I actually don't think Alabaster Box helps us either because we can't pick up Spirit Hearts. Pop, it can be a risky pickup, but I like it from time to time. And I'm going to finish this train of thought, I swear to you. Things like the sacrifice room that usually you can't get to work on every floor, all of a sudden become extraordinarily valuable. I know I said that with a lot of sass, valuable. <laughs> In uh, terms where it is playable, it is very abusable to get these to work out for me here. And you'll see, you know, you'll sacrifice rooms, anything, in this game that spawns items uh, can be very abusable. So that's just, that's food for thought. That's where we're gonna leave that one. And unfortunately we did get Spirit Heart drop instead of money. The 30 cents would have been the best case scenario. And then teleporting to deal with the angel was also a, a somewhat best case scenario. So the library, uh, one of the one things we really couldn't control on this floor. And it, it was great that we got it, but truthfully there's really no plan for that. The real thing I was looking forward to is Sacrifice Rooms. And I hope by the end of this run, we will have seen something nice come from that. Oh yeah, it's, okay, so it's the gray gray pooper, which means uh, we all know. Uh, it's one super fast leap. And he also spawns spiders. Dingle and his variants are one. And, ah, old bandage. Historically, and you all know my opinions on old bandage. It's one of the best HP ups in the game. Um, wait, did Wooden Nickel say it's a 59% chance to get a kick? Whoa, I thought it was 50 50. That's cool. Didn't know that. Did not know that at all. But he's one of those characters, again, where we do have some strong advantages. Like with weird HP, there's a lot of things you can consider differently. And one of them is uh, sacrifice rooms, for sure. And another one's curse rooms. You know, what's. Oh. Oh, hello. Purity's cool. Well, it gave me the speed one. That's fine. But, you know, we're going to be able to get into these curse rooms as long as there's a couple pennies laying around. As you just saw, we got a really nice... Oh. 
Okay, well, I don't... I don't want the range one. I'm fine with either speed, tears, or damage here. You tell me. Okay, tears is great. Tears is really great. Now we've got a super busted tier rate. Purity might just be an insane pickup for us. Might be one of the best in the run if we can hold on to that tier up. So that's that's somewhat exciting. And it's one of those runs it's probably best to go to the shop first. I won't deny it. And so there's some things we're looking for from the shop. Namely, things like car battery. Things like wooden nickel. And car battery work really well together. Um, is this... Let's Isaac open shops for free, but it doesn't really say anything about whether or not it makes them greed free. I believe that's rib of greed that would do something like that. So I'm not entirely interested in holding Sorky uh, as my you know be all end all trinket. Okay, two stone chest is certainly tempting. I mean, there's there's no denying that. But I, oh, hello. But I want to see my options in the shop. So. A lot of things that pimp out the space bar item are just going to inherently help greed. Uh, deep pockets is going to help greed. Keeper sack is going to help. Oh, I'm sorry, I keep saying greed. I'm keeper. Um, all these things that can help keeper, you know, are, are something we're definitely in the market for. And yeah, yeah. okay, let's just. And there might be a mom's key waiting around. There's, there's a proper, you know, order when we've got this much money by caves one. Yeah, it's 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 fun keeper is a really fun guy he i don't even know if i really fully fleshed out like his start uh not a very well thought out character i think when he dropped i think that's i think you might get you know some hate for saying something like that maybe not but for people who know like with people who lived it you know with, with greed when he when he came out i think a lot of us would say exactly what i said where it just you know he didn't fit into the game at all now that deals with the devil with him costs money. Now that, you know, he's got three red hearts, or three coin hearts instead of two. And uh, there's just, few, there's more ways to make him work, I think, is, uh, is has obviously helped a great deal for my love of that character. Um, so, jumper cables is one where I think you're happy to have it, to be completely honest. Ooh, BFFs is obviously good. Mama Mega is obviously good. But we're going to see, you know, it's, it's time to be picky. When you've got money, you certainly have the option to be picky. And unfortunately here, that's all we get. Um, but I will buy the sack. Okay. Got a key in a bomb. So, uh, overall good. The, the real taker, the real winner there might be blue map. Uh, blue map is just so good. Is this a snare? Okay. I didn't want to miss it. But also, like, I did not want to mess with the secret room from that shooting guy's area. So we know that this floor is empty. It's fine to pick up all of our money now. And we're hoping for a speed up. I'm fine with, like, a speed ball, a roid rage. Um, is growth hormones a speed up? Is it damage speed? Not sure. Oh, okay. So Mongo Baby's cool. At the moment, does nothing. And BFF could have really helped that out, but... It's also BFF. It wasn't really gonna... We're not saving lives here. <laughs> and I'll go to the second secret room because we know where it is. There's no reason not to. Same reason now. There's no reason not to pop those two stone chests. It's all it's all for the betterment of humanity. And what we got? We got flies. So it'd be a good time probably go to the boss and use these flies. But at the same time, I don't... I'm tired of coming back. With 0.9 speed, you're not gonna see me like... Oh... lame -o. Didn't, uh, didn't love losing my tears up there, but we have done it. <laughs> and Vibrant Bulb might be the best play. Entering Angel Room. Uh, I mean, I don't know. Maybe, maybe hold on to Vibrant Bulb. And just see what happens. There's, there's probably, I mean... How often am I going to have it? You know, I don't know. What I do know is actually it is helpful because in between rooms like this, I will have 1.65 speed, which is insane. No, I won't have 1.65, but on the bosses and stuff, I'll take that speed down and stuff. But I'm more than happy to have that speed up in between rooms. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. That'll, that'll cut down travel time by a considerable amount. Use my wisps as projectiles there. Doesn't bother me. And unfortunately, we got another damage uh, HP up. 
which sucks. We that's that's exactly what we don't need. And so we've already gotten two of them for two out of three boss rooms of an HP. That's not great. It's not something you want to be, you know, hoping that continues. That's that's for sure. Uh, I'm fine taking a hit, dude, honestly, because I don't know if we actually lost our deal with the devil chance the last time we did take a hit. Just to try and reroll off of speed and get back tears. Oh, hello. Tears is great. Tears is the best one. It's it breaks the tier cap for triple shot, and that's you know just unbelievably better. So we'll go in here. Oh, hello. Yeah, that could have killed me. <laughs> yeah, that, that absolutely could have killed me. That's funny. Should uh should have been careful there for sure. I don't know if I really was. But we'll pick up our penny. Blue map either way is insanely valuable. Um. Did I get my speed back again? I did, didn't I? Okay, for 59% of the time, I feel like I don't get a whole lot of... And I'm from a vault, I got a tears up. That is insanely shocking to me. I'm stunned. I am stunned that that actually happened. So we're going to use these again. Hit some guys, get some money. It's all good in the hood. A placebo. It's just these things are not good enough. You buy the consumables because 10 cents to me at this point is, is, is legitimate jump change, so. Oh boy, I didn't hit, didn't kill. Whoa. I hope you guys are having a good day. I, I definitely am. You know, my days just kind of started and it feels like I'll have some time here to play some Isaac and then, oh, and I did not lose my deal with the devil. All right, very good to know. So, Keeper is completely immune to losing his odds. Uh, good to know. Good, really good to know. And I mean, dude, we don't have any bombs. We'll put one on this this wall. See what we can see. It's a key. Excellent. Just excellent. Let's find our item room. We keep getting that speed up, don't we? Okay. You don't blow up? I thought you blew up when I touched you. No, it's just when you die. I have learned something new. I have learned something very new. What do we get? That time was okay. There's our tears, right? So that's this is the one we're keeping. Still, uh, <clears throat> still waiting for that 59% game. That I've heard so much about. You need to see, and with popped especially, like your defensive ability just just goes through the roof. I mean, we're laying down absolute insane cover fire. Boom! Later, bozo. Love it. Okay. <laughs> Okay, I tell you what, this is, we do this because we want Magic Mush. <laughs> Can you imagine if we got it there, though? That would have been insane. I'm going to look for an arcade. Oh, no, there's no point in the vault spawned already. We're good. We're going to move. We're going to boot scoot and boogie on out of here. We also are definitely going to go to the second secret room now that we have so many bombs. Oh, nice, actually. Very happy with this. A ragman fight. Yippee. But we got some money. We got a card, which is the devil. The devil's a good card. Oh, almost walked over that spike. Okay, especially for this guy. Man, oh man. We're going to let him break some rock, do his thing. You know. Now, if we had lost contact, this would be a great run because we shoot so many shots and they sit in the air. That, uh, oh man. That is unfortunate. I wish that... The keeper had that. Also, this again is my favorite floor in the game. I don't know how it wouldn't be yours. Honestly, I don't even want to open this because if it's tinted rock or if it's small rock, I had a real hard decision to make there. Going to 0.7 speed is honestly it buns. We missed our 48% chance, Angel. So now we have a guaranteed something on this floor. So we kind of went from like getting super lucky to just kind of getting shafted. Um, so three three HP ups uh, across all caves and and basements not good not a good place to be that really doesn't help us anywhere uh, it it does though it does allow me to say hey purity is even better than we thought because it might be a, a while before we get some real stats and, and obviously wire coat hanger there on that last floor is going to be crucial like it's all going to matter now so just something to think about. Oh my lord. Sir, you gotta calm down. These wisps are great, though. Uh, defensively, really good. 
when I run into enemies with them, they turn into money. Which I think is good. I think most people would agree. Yeah, now is also the time to start thinking of when I want to use my Emperor card. I can probably hold on to it for a decent amount of time and just skip through Womb, honestly. Uh, that, that's a very valuable play. Uh, uh, skipping a Womb Floor is, is insane uh, for the longevity of a run. And we're going we're gonna, to we're gonna hold on that because we've got some plays to make. Also, no boss challenge rooms, which could also kind of cheese and put some money in there for ourselves. Go in, you know, and oh, hey, we're low HP, and then just suck it down like a freaking a goblin. I don't know. I there's there's still plenty of time for that to happen. Uh, respawn is the lost on death. Obviously, to have a, a death respawn, a really good, really good thing in general. Uh, Vibrant bulb right now is just is more appealing. I'm not entirely worried about dying. Maybe that comes across as cocky. I'm not quite sure. Uh, yeah, it's not a time for pills. Pills could just completely maul this run. Um, almost irreparably. A tears down here, a speed down here, something like that is just a stat down we can't really afford to take. Because uh, honestly, in my opinion, once you get to depths like... You should have something to show for it, and uh, we kind of do. We, we get, we're building something again. You know, it's definitely we're we're a sh we're a grower here, not a shower. Okay. <laughs> and hive mind, so hive mind, and we'll buy. We'll, we'll take the lot. I mean, there's no reason not to. Temperance is an interesting one. I don't know how well it actually works. Um, so you go. Yes. Does he give money? Oh, what have I done? I don't I don't want to do that. Yeah, give me my tears up back, please. Thank you. So you could conceivably take Temperance card. Oh, it might be worth it for a speed, a blood bag speed up. The problem is I just can't see my HP. And that that is, oh, how did I not get hit? That is a problem. Uh, honestly, that is a problem. Because I won't really know. I won't be able to... I'll have to make a serious mental effort. Right now, I believe I'm at full HP. That might not even be the case. So, kind of kind of hard here. Squeezy's honestly really solid, man. I mean, it is. And I didn't have enough money. <sighs> Hopefully, it stays open. No. That's a kick in the pants. I got the low odds deal with the devil. I was already counting on deal with the angel. Oh. Okay, I'm not going to lie to you guys. I am very bummed out at the moment. <laughs> we just had a chance at Incubus. And uh, didn't, get it, didn't get it done. So, I'm not feeling particularly great at the moment. Alright, well now we know we're at full HP and I've been picking up all the money. Oh my god. What am I doing, man? What am I doing? I'm throwing. That's what I'm doing. So let's get ourselves back in this, huh? What do we know that happened on this floor? We missed out on Incubus. Big L. For sure. But, we're still alive. As long as we're still alive, we've got a very good chance at winning. Just needs to, uh, just just a few things need to fall in place. That's it. That's all you need. So we're gonna try and get a speed up here. Blood bag would go, would would feed generations here. That's the play. Okay. I mean, you ask and you receive. You know, that's that's the name of the dang game. Uh, and we're gonna do some rerolling, some light rerolling to get our very own uh, speed speed up off of us and instead get the I think damage is fine but you know we yeah the tears one is is just insanely better and uh, so I mean you hate to see it right I mean I, I feel like I left so much on the table um, but we'll, we'll fight this uh, just in case there's something in there you know you, you don't know it's time to start playing like anything uh, could be the difference uh, is the answer honestly I feel locked in though so I I don't want to I don't want to continue just yapping about uh, how worried I am but you know, I feel locked in now so it's good 
just it's frustrating because I feel like we could have been even better than good uh, at several points in this run. And down to depths two. So we came down, we got we got tears up, which is actually wonderful. Uh, it was squeezy. We got hive mind, which is really good to build on. And we got uh, blood bag, which is a great speed up. So a lot of good things. And curse of the lost blows. Um, because it's gonna hurt our, our our tracking. We're gonna have to make a real good effort not to drop too many pennies in uh, bad places. As I immediately drop a freaking penny. <laughs> yeah, man. I this this is these are the trickier floors for sure. That's uh, steps two. So we see the boss room. We're running the opposite way. I'm not ready for it. Uh, I need to make sure that I'm ready for seeing the shop. That's the big one. Shop's the real big one. Oh, here's the seed though. Um, so if you guys are interested in playing this one, which you should, uh, Incubus is sitting there uh, for somebody smarter than I to uh, to definitely acquire. And it's still best practice to leave that uh, money. So we've got money, man. We've got money. If this is a paying shop, we're, we're happy as a clam. And Broken Modem's, Broken Modem's excellent. There's, there's actually nothing you need to be told about Broken Modem that you don't already know. That's for sure. We'll pick up this... Uh, damn, man. I, I, so, ah, uh, this run is built insanely well for a character that does, that does have red HP. Uh, with old bandage, um, being the headliner there. And, uh, now Maggie's bow, which would have made healing stuff twice effective. All your short, your short was single IV bag from being the most broken character you've ever seen as far as money is concerned. But... If it makes any of you feel better, the shops have not been that, like, you know, prosperous. They have been, but they also haven't been, if you know what I'm saying. We've gotten some good items, but we could have had, like, a restock machine in one of them and then had a ton more items. So, relative. It's all relative. Now, what did we get? We got the speed up again, and this is interesting. Where did we get the range? We got the range up. We don't want the dang range up, man. Get me, get me out of here. Yay, okay. That really that really helps a lot, I'm not gonna lie. It's a real good uh, breath. Ooh, so this is this is our moment. This is honestly our our moment. Uh, consolation prize is a fire rate up, so look at this. Ha uh ha! -huh. <laughs> we can take it. And uh, currently we're speedier than the, the fastest man alive right now. But once we get, oh dear. If we're 1 HP, I'm going to Emperor card. Oh, dang it, I don't have the full card. Maybe I don't want to do that. Okay, this is going to be an interesting one, to say the least. I got to uh, not take damage like a buffoon. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Wisps. You know, he's... Monstro 2 has changed a lot. He used to be very uh, trainable. Like, he used to be able to infinite laser him. Now he really favors that laser after the fly spawn, which makes it a little tougher. And we're fine sitting with this all stats up for now, honestly. Get rid of him, I don't wanna see the laser shots. <laughs> and to still be here with, I believe, base damage. It, it looks higher than it should, though. What did we get? Nothing, I don't think. Okay. What do we get? Damage is fine. It's nothing wrong with a little damage here and there. Oh, it's a sticky nickel. Okay, fair enough. Oh, yeah. So now... Okay, now where was the boss? I saw him. Saw the item room. Saw the shop. Saw the arcade. Saw the curse room? No, saw the boss trap. Moss. Moss. Boss trap. Uh, the boss challenge. Okay, so this is definitely the wrong way. Um, no, not good. Oh. No. Oh, I did not see the curse room. There it is. Doesn't matter if it's a damage up or not. We are going in here anyway. 
Because we can. That's the strength of the character. And we got our tears up back. So life is life is smooth as can be. There we go. Lucky Penny. I told you. I told you guys. We were just around the corner here for some good news. Now, I know this is the wrong way. Because I've seen the boss room. I think it was down. Um, but it's certainly possible we're going to see... Thank you, Broken Modem. We're going to see a library or some special room that, you know, is, is just waiting. I just don't know. If it's a sacrifice room at this point, I won't play. Uh, there's just, I, there's too many pennies on this random floor. I'm not gonna be able to play that well. And wow, I mean, this is a deep, oh, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I have not found the boss. What the heck was I talking about? Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. Did not even realize. So Red Mom off the rip means you got to be careful because the foot is coming down, man. And she shoots now from her eyeball. And I'm in a corner. Don't want to be there. Last place you want to be. But she broke my tinted rock for me, which is definitely what we want to see. Broken modem, thank you. You're a real G. <laughs> and we're doing all right. That was good. And, and we did get a low odds deal with the angel. So what did we get? Uh, Gent... Genesis. Ooh. So. You take it? Um. <laughs> I'm not loving it. I'm not loving it. I think you take it, though, for just the meme. The thing is, we don't have that many items. I don't know if you do take it. Because if you lose purity, you lose the run. That's like a, I mean, I don't want to say guaranteed, but that's, that's a legitimate factor. Um, this is a, this is a tricky one, man. This is not, this is not easy to make the call. I'm going to lead Genesis on the ground. It's hard because I really do want to do it, but I got to remind myself that Genesis goes off of item pool, and we don't have that many items from like strong item pools. Like it's all random. Like we got a couple shop items, we got a couple some we got HP. Oh, I guess we could we could have turned the HPs into something. That's a good point. The run probably would look a lot different if that was the case. Instead, we're gonna we're gonna thug it out though for sure. <laughs> the longer I can hold on to this Emperor card. The better I get. Oh, nice. So here we go, right? Like, we can still make plays. <laughs> There's still things to do. Uh, this is far from over. <laughs> Unfortunately, I had to lose my tear up there, but all good things have to come to an end. <laughs> and we got the damage up instead, so I don't know. I will take a hit. Yay, okay. Yeah, that one's going to sit with me, though. I honestly would love to know what you guys would do. Um, that's a tough one. That is actually a tough call. Um, the thing about Genesis is if you live by the bird in the hand is worth two in the bush, Genesis is the worst pickup in the game uh, for you. But also, like, it has an insane amount of potential. Especially on this one. Like, what am I doing with the quarter at this point, right? Like, what, what am I doing with all these HP ups? Um... There's just some things I'm not willing to lose. <laughs> I don't know. I don't feel good about it. I think I think a very serious case should have been made on my behalf for Genesis. I think I should have done a better job. I think I, I, think I really should have just rocked with Genesis uh, in general. Uh, could be good. Could be something we want to do here. It could also be something we don't want to do here, so... I'm fine, and we're still rocking and rolling, baby. We are still alive, and I'm excited. This is uh, Utero 1, okay? Utero 1, not bad. Day Long Legs, historically not the tankiest of bosses, so I feel good. And we're rocking, man. This is this is life, all right? We, we, oh, my. Does he always guess where you are? I feel like that was a preemptive head fall. Although then again, 1.2 speed, you're not Lightning McQueen. Although we, I'm very grateful to have it. 1.2 is, is nice. I'll pick up a penny. I don't think you, okay, you can kill him on the legs. 
Didn't get the uh, whatever. And a damage and range up at this point uh, in Blood Clot, which is good <laughs> in its own way. Now let's rock. Oh gosh, when do you use the Emperor card, man? When do you do it? Not on this floor. Ooh. So I think that's our first like official damage up. Am I mistaken? No, I'm definitely not. I'm definitely not. We have not gotten any damage ups. So here's what you do. We're gonna explore the floor now because there's a ton of money in here. Okay, so we're not gonna we're not gonna worry about all the, the pocket change on the floor in every room. We have one room where there's a ton of money. If there's a sacrifice room, we are absolutely going in, uh, going yard. Okay, there's there's really no reason not to send it on this point. Oh, hello. And we got a range up. Okay. <laughs> Is this a way up? I think I saw that. Yeah. Hey, nice. An arcade. Oh, I see that though. Lucky Penny. Always welcome. And there we go. So that's, this is where things get fun. We're going to have a chance to get in there. That's for sure. I'll, I'll tell you that for free. What do we got? Trapicamide. Um, is not the craziest item we could have produced in that room. Um, I might grab it though, just just because an item's an item. What if there's Libra? You know, like you, it's just we gotta play as if there's ow. We gotta play as if that matters. Does it matter? I have no idea. Oh. Okay, one second. I don't know how it's trapicamide, man. Let's just. Let's cut our freaking losses and walk away. I don't want the range up. It gave me the game. Classic. Classic, classic. Classic Isaac, you funny, funny, funny Isaac. Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm not fancying speed either. Is that fair to say? Oh, okay, well that's uh, excellent. That's exactly what we wanted, actually. And we got the damage up, which is good. And let's rock. Now would be a totally fine place to Emperor. I'm just hoping I bump into the Sacrifice Room on the way. This Emperor card really is only like a get out of, like a save me from immediate harm into the frying pan, out of my frying pan, like into the fire type moment. I don't know. <laughs> like, it's not a good idea to use it on like Isaac and be like, oh, I'm about to die. Well, I better, better rip. Uh, don't, don't want to do that. But if I have to, I have to. It's things like this, you know. Okay. Can't take it for granted. Uh, I cannot take it for granted. What do we got? What do we get? We get the damage. Okay. So I kind of felt like I knew the boss wasn't gonna be over here. I don't. I came over for the second secret room. That's why. Took me a second. I remembered why I'm here. Oh, the moon card is better. The moon card is ooh, nice. So this is the room where well, we get something good. Cricket leg could be good. <laughs> but uh, we'll never know. <laughs> we'll never know. Uh, oh, no. I've gone the wrong way. It might be worth emperoring just for my sanity. But I gotta think, dude, this is... <laughs> it's a fun run. We d I definitely very much feel in it, you know? Strength. Um, a very good card. Probably good one enough to take to, like, Isaac for sure. You know, he's weak and takes double damage. Like, anything to make that fight easier is a friend of mine, I, I would think. And I know what I said about the Lucky Pennies. I do. Uh, that's actually way better. There is no question that's better. Um, because we get a mapping for the next floor. Which means really if I want to see the sacrifice room. I'll know if it's there or not. And then I'll just beeline for it. 
Broken Modem, I mean, dude, there's not enough things to say. Broken Modem used to just suck, and now it's legitimately an insanely good item that I think if you don't have it, you're you're missing out. You're not happy about that. We got the deal with the Angel. That's awesome. Censure and Act of Contrition. Oh, God. Okay. What's better at this point? Uh, slows down enemies and projectiles or a tears up? I think... I think... It's, it's tough. It is tough. Um, gonna go censure. Gonna see if that does anything. If it doesn't... I don't know what to tell you, man. I tried my best. <laughs> um, okay, curse the blind. Obviously not what you want to see. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> so curse the tower is really not what you want to see. Um, and don't worry, we got breakfast. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Can't help but feel nervous now. I mean, <laughs> if, you, if you haven't already, I certainly would. Um, Got to get in there to the Mr. What are they even called? What, what is that guy even called? I don't even know. Uh, censure is good. Okay, I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to feel good about that one. I think slow, it just, you can't say too many good things about it. There's, there's, there's always one more thing that's, that's really good about it. It is it's one of the best, okay? It's just one of the best in the biz. Uh, my tier rate is not one of the best in the biz, so I did have to make a serious uh, business decision. What did I get? What is my what is my all stat? My range? God damn it. <laughs> I don't want range. But I don't have any HP, so I'm not going to purposely take hits. That's just crazy stupid at this point to be doing that. Um, so there's no sacrifice room, which it makes the plays a little less likely. That's all I'm going to say about that. I'm not going to get some crazy item on this floor. It's just not going to happen. We tried. We got Actually, we did get a crazy item. Uh, my definition of crazy, though, is uh, <laughs> Curse of the Tower. <laughs> oh, I forgot I had that. Okay. All right. We'll do We'll let them, let them cook. All right. Well, we know where we're going. That's all that really matters, okay? We're still, we're still happy about that. Um. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I, this run would be so different, you guys, if I had Incubus. Do you understand? <laughs> this is like... I mean, it's like it's a wonderful life. Like there's there's a few moments, right? It's, it's some runs you can't tell. Some runs you can't tell where the defining moment is. I think it's very, very clear where the defining moment is on this run. And that is where I could not afford uh, Incubus. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm having fun. I really am. I, I'm loving this. I hope you guys are having fun. Um, I wonder what uh, you guys are doing this weekend. I know for me, I'm going to a concert actually, kind of funny enough. Um, and if you must know, it's Earth, Wind, and Fire. <laughs> Which you might say, I, don't, I wouldn't have expected that to be your thing. That's fair. Um, that's fair. But I, I have a thing for the older musics. I really do. Um, last winter, this past winter, I saw Eagles. So I saw them live as well. So it's, again, that, that kind of thing of like, man, it would be so amazing to have watched these guys and girls like at the peak. But I was also born at just the right time to really get all these farewell tours that, you know, I wouldn't really had a chance at otherwise. I would have been waiting for them anyway. So what have I, what, 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 what? Okay, I'm going to blow myself up here just for the clout. And I got damage. Okay, fair enough. Well, we got to the hardest. We, we, I mean, geez. One more floor to go. Let's. Let me just say that. Montezuma's revenge. Oh. Ooh. Okay. So, uh, some very good items all of a sudden showing up here. Tech. Oh, wait a minute. Technology works really well. I like that a lot. Now let's go, and do some damage. I think technology might have been the move. I'm loving it. Oh yeah, Montezuma's. I got the Zuma. I got the Zoomies. <laughs> I don't mind taking hits in this room. Because um, there's so much money laying around. What did I get? I don't want the damage. I want the tears. Can you do that for me? I'm just going to start taking hits. Oh, super stupid to do, though, because 
curse the tower. Right, right, right. Um, range, I certainly don't want. We'll take a hit. <laughs> oh my gosh. Good chest, though, all things considered. I mean, we got some really good items. Uh, and oh, yo, listen. Speed up, okay. Oh my gosh, we actually got lost contact. That's cool. That's exactly what uh, I had. I had literally name dropped this exact thing. <laughs> okay, take a hit because you only live once. And honestly, I'm fine with how we're living. Um, <laughs> lost contact, very good. I cannot believe we actually found it. Um, so now our tiers that just kind of mingle are going to be defensive assets. We have a very good... Honestly, if we did better damage, I could be very much persuaded into a Mega Satan because we block all his projectiles and we, we, we run enough interference, it wouldn't even be an issue. But I don't want to get ahead of myself. We're not even at the boss yet. We aren't even there yet. Montezuma's Revenge, I really should be using a lot more. It's, it's a very good item, honestly, especially on its own. Like, if you don't have anything else, like, play for Montezuma's, it's, it's really good. <laughs> Just a little requir- you know, a little adjusting required, that's all. Uh, oh, yes, thank you. you listen. Oh, God. No, I don't want the speed, okay, I don't. Whoa! <laughs> what did it give me? Range? Oh, good lord. Get me, get me out of here. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> No. No, I don't want to die. Okay, don't want to do that. Tears up's great. We got Virus, which is another speed up. So now we've got, I mean, phenomenal speed. Okay, that's... Something should be celebrated. We were at 0.9. We got all the way to 1.95 through all these memes. And you gotta love it. You gotta love it. It was a good run, man. It really was. A fun one. The only part that always gets me, though, is leaving stuff on the table, uh, as far as strength-wise goes. You know, I, I see there is an Incubus potential, so it's like, you know, wish I had it. But now, we get to really show the Lost Contact strength, which is this bozo is not going to shoot anything. As you can see, I mean, he is not, he's shot nothing. Nothing's come out. So... You see what I'm saying? Very good defensive build. Uh, it came, came at the very end, but, I mean, it is a very strong defensive build. Gotta love stuff like that. You really do. And that's, and that's Pop and Lost Contact, baby. And that is Keeper. That's the seed. I hope you guys enjoyed that one. I, I, <laughs> I can't complain. A win's a win, man. Um, and I'm excited for the next few characters, man. We're almost done. We're almost around the ring. So, I'll see you all for, uh, for the next one, man. And, 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 no, I think you actually all are men still. I have not checked the analytics in a while. But I'm gonna say that pretty confidently. <laughs>